Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, and we got Jeremy Ford over here. And we're gonna do a review of a beverage from China. It's a Ramune, Ramune, Ramune. Why are you so new, new, Ramune? Ramune. <clears throat> Strawberry flavored. We just did the original, which was just it was just a sweet, it was just a sweet kind of water. It was really good. Uh, Shirakiku brand, it's carbonated, strawberry flavored, artificial flavor. It says no strawberry juice. If you're wondering, uh, calories are eighty. The nutrition facts are pretty bare. Total carbs is 19 grams. <clears throat> Total sugar is 17 grams. Includes 17 grams added sugars. Calcium, 3 milligrams. That's about it. Ingredients in this one is carbonated water, fructose glucose syrup mixed with sugar, citric acid, artificial flavor. Um, same exact ingredients. Except on this, except uh, where do you go? This one doesn't say red number 40 because this one didn't say red because it didn't have any color in it. So, <clears throat> product of Japan. One was product of China, and that, this one's a product of Japan. I think the chips were China. Oh, is that right? That's right. We reviewed some <laughs> chips from China. So this one is from Japan as well then. Yeah, there it is. I don't know if I even read that. You said Japan about the fat cat on this bottle. Now this one doesn't have artwork on it. It just has some Japanese writing. Okay, we're going to have Jeremy open this for us. He's got it down pretty good now. Kind of an interesting way to open it. Get that plastic off there. There's a mm -hmm. cap underneath. Inside the cap, you pop out this little plunger thing. And you take that plunger and you stick it in that top hole like that. And you push down firmly. Until, until it hits like that and rattles your teeth. <laughs> Man. So then that pops the marble loose. Mm -hmm. and now you got a marble in your bottle and there's nothing you can do about it. So don't even try. Mm -hmm. See that in there? And then after that, it's safe to drink. Mm hmm Kind of smells Kool Aid y, kind of, doesn't it? Mm hmm. <clears throat> get a better, better aroma, get it out of there. You don't get all of it out. No matter how hard you try, that marble is not going to let... Eh, it let a little bit loose. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Nice red color there. Back it up a little bit. There we go. Now, oh, man, that's more Kool-Aid kind of an aroma. Mm-hmm. Kind of a combination of strawberry. It might be a little cherry too. Just a little bit. What mm -hmm. you think? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. Mm -hmm. it smells good. Mm -hmm. 
Let's see what we got here. It's not as sweet as it is on the aroma, but it is sweet. Mm -hmm. It's not like a big sugary type, real sweet type of a drink. Um, so if you're wondering if it's that way, it's not. Um, I've had that glucose and something else. I don't remember what it was. If it was like, it's in something else. It's similar to like a seltzer, because it kind of fades out into that kind of bitterish um, seltzer taste at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It does have that kind of characteristic to it. I mean, is it kind of like it doesn't say um, electrolytes on it, so it's not like an energy drink or like a <clears throat> like Gatorade. Mm -hmm. um, but it seems like Gatorade has. I want to say it has glucose in it or something like that. Maybe I'm thinking electrolytes. I don't know. Glucose, doesn't it have something to do with blood sugar or something? I'm not sure. <clears throat> do you know what that is, honey? What? Glucose? Have you heard, you've heard of that? Yeah. This has something to do with it's sugar? It has something to do with sugar. <clears throat> uh, maybe it's, I was thinking maybe it has something to do with blood sugar um, or something like that. It sounds like that. Maybe it can hurt you, but I ain't gonna think. <clears throat> it's good. The other one said refreshing on it. This one doesn't. Glucose is a simple sugar that your body uses for energy. Oh. Glucose is a simple sugar. A simple sugar that your body uses for energy. That your body uses for energy. Man, I need to get me a whole case of these. I'm ready to go. It's good. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the strawberry kind of sticks around throughout the entirety of it. Mm-hmm. Even now, you, you get, it's kind of lingering a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, whereas mm -hmm. the other one didn't have like all that much flavor in it, in it, so you get just a little bit more of a seltzer, kind of a dull, kind of a taste that comes a little quicker but uh just good good stuff don't see anything wrong with it there you go all right well thank you martin for sitting Did you hear that? <laughs> Thanks, Martin, for sending these to us. We appreciate it. Um, it's been interesting checking these things out. Mm -hmm. I alienize kind of thing. We're supposed to use to pour it. It's supposed to keep the marble from rolling up to the, to the mouth of it. Ah. Like this? Mm. Or like that? Yeah, because it cradles the... Here it holds it there. Ah, oh, that's how you get more out of it. Okay, see, so there's two inventions here. So when you pour it, you have to pour it like this. Mm -hmm. And it, the marble is captured by um, uh, those two inventions that are inside the bottle now. And it's going to keep the marble there so that you can get all the beverage out of the bottle. 
here, here I was trying to get get the rest of it out, and it was blocking my way every time. But if you do it that way, you get it off. Okay, cool. Excuse me. Okay, well, we'll end it there. Thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. Thanks to Martin and Kuhn again. And we'll see you all on the next one. Bye.